set the white balance to house negro. That's about my, <laughs> that's about my complexion. Tell me, what's it like being black? <laughs> I had a friend say, but as a white person, I find it really hard to talk about race. Oh. Have you ever been the, um, like the token black guy at a party? All the fucking time. I know there's like some really funny, like coded topics that like white people will bring up around you to kind of like show that like they're liberal sure, they're, or like they're an ally. Yeah. Like sp getting into specifics, like I love like the whole conversation about like the wire. <laughs> like the wire yes. is the best TV The wire show. is my favorite show. You know? Have you seen it? Why yeah, you gotta yeah. like, you gotta show your badge that you're like black approved. I say, yeah, I'm a musician. It's like, oh, cool. I like jazz. <laughs> that, that happens more often than Did you have did. a saxophone in your hand with you? <laughs> I always have a saxophone with me. <laughs> so like, I find that the like well-meaning uh, white people thing often boils down to, I don't know how to do this really hard, difficult work. So I'm just gonna kind of put it in your lap to deal with, which is that like, that's a burden. Right? One, it presumes that like, as a person of color, I know everything about being a person of color. Like a, you're like a magical black person. Like, right, yeah. Like bagger pants. <laughs> magical Negro. <laughs> I don't have that, that like, the, power. The oh, magical, did. that what Negro did. pixie dust? You don't, don't have no, that? No, no. You didn't get at the meeting? God damn it. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I said too much. Like they're, like, they're all different types of white people, but for some reason they think all black people talk this one way and act this one way and, you know, we all, like sneakers and See, listen to Wu Tang or whatever. And it's just not. I mean, I love Wu Tang; they're great. But like, you know, there's there's different types of black people too. But just accept the premise that you were going to be wrong. That is a part of being a, a human person. Like we'll get beyond just like uh, Quincy's black. He's my friend. To like Quincy's black. He's my friend, and um, he's dealing with shit that I need to be actively um, trying to work against. These conversations are sort of bubbling to the surface, and people who were not a part of those communities are now starting to hear those conversations that don't necessarily represent their identities, but like, yeah, I don't know. I feel like people are kind of catching on. What's it like being black? In America. What's it like to be 